Hey everyone, it's Tiffany with Thrifty Tiffany. I am back with a Dollar Tree recipe. First you preheat the oven to 425. You get a nine by 13 glass pan and you get five tablespoons of butter. You put them on there and then you preheat that in the oven so the butter will melt. Um, the ingredients that you'll need is again, the five tablespoons of butter. Again, this is from Dollar Tree. Six eggs, one cup of flour, milk now this one obviously is from kroger but you can get milk in the carton from the um dollar tree salt vanilla and cinnamon and those are all from the dollar tree this recipe this is my first time making it it's german pancakes and um it asks for you to blend the ingredients instead of like mixing them um so we're going to use my ninja to do that and um, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this to get the butter melted and I'm gonna start cracking the eggs and putting, putting them in here. Okay, so I have the six eggs in here and then I'm gonna just add the other things. I'm gonna add the flour, a pinch, pinch of salt, just sprinkle some vanilla and sprinkle some cinnamon. Okay, literally that was the exact amount of room that I needed in this cup. So I have the eggs, the cinnamon, the vanilla, the pinch of salt, the one cup of flour, one cup of milk, and that's it. And I'm going to blend it in my Ninja. I don't have a food processor or it just said, um, it didn't say to mix, it just said to blend. <clears throat> okay, I have it in here and this is gonna be really loud. So I'm just gonna show you how loud it's gonna be. That's so loud. So I will do this off the camera. <laughs> Okay, so I have that heated up, it melted, and then I'm gonna show you what you do next. I'm so excited for this recipe because I've never had it, but it looks so good. Okay, so this is the consistency it should look. It looks pretty watery, so that's what it should look like. And then what you do, because this is all nice and hot, you just pour this in. I'm so excited, y'all. So today is election day. Uh, my kids are out of school, and I took off of work because uh, Cash um, was going to go get his learner's license. Now, Cash is about to be 16, and he still has not got his learner's license yet. For some reason, these kids these days don't seem to care about getting their license. But So we had scheduled, we had everything in line, and then I sent him to school. Look how pretty this is. I sent him to school with his... Um, with a piece of paper he had to fill out that showing that he was still in school that the school had to fill out he just left it in the office and did not bring it home he just gave it to him i told him to get it filled out and bring it home so yes so now we can't go get that today but we have it on 425 i'm about to put it in the oven i think it goes from 20 to 22 minutes or from 22 to 25 i'll let you guys know on the next clip okay so quick question my kids tell me i have a coffee cup addiction now to me, I mean, it's not, a, this is just one cabinet, so I'm not like extreme. That's Tupperware on the top, that's cups, plates and bowls. So that's my only plates and bowls. Um, well, plastic, I have glass, of course. But these are like to-go cups, water cups, coffee, tall coffee cups, and we have coffee cups galore all through in there, and coffee cups here, but like I want to make a wall, but I don't know which wall to put it on for like to hang coffee cups. I have this coffee cup thing here, but this is for like, that is a set that went together. And these are the big ones that I got from the Dollar Tree that are for like oatmeal or grits. And then so I keep all my drinking cups up here, but I want to build like a rack to hold them. Um, So yeah. And then I'll show you. And then so here's my other cup, but these are like regular drinking cups for the kids. Of course, all of those are from the Dollar Tree. Those are, but I have some coffee cups here, some water cups here, just some different cups there. Um, does this look excessive to you guys? To me, it doesn't, but my kids make fun of me all the time. Like you completely have an addiction, mom. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all look at this look at this i have never made german pancakes that's like butter in it right there o m g so it rises oh 
this is going to be amazing. I think it's done. Honestly, I forgot to set the timer, but by the looks of it, it looks done. Look at this beauty, guys. Look at it. And then you sprinkle some powdered sugar. I got this from the Dollar Tree. And I put it in my little container. And then syrup. And you can get uh, syrup from the Dollar Tree as well. But this one's from Kroger. Oh my gosh. This looks to die for. So good. Okay. So I'm going to cut this to see what it turns out like so excited okay so this is it added powdered sugar syrup the bottom stuck a little bit which is weird because it had all that butter on the bottom and I don't know why the bottom stuck but we will see okay we're gonna try Kaya's fixing hers right there let me know Kaya let's taste Mmm. Kind of tastes like French toast. And you can add fruit to it, bananas. Oh, yum. And it's quick. It's way quicker than French toast. Honestly, even pancakes because you don't have to sit there and flip each one. Ooh, that's good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Definitely try it. Mmm. The boys loved it. Cayman's on his second. It's so good, y'all. It tastes like French toast. I think this is going to be a Christmas breakfast for Christmas morning. It's so good. Definitely try it.